So another week, another Foot Champions bonus. Okay, they're just copy and paste now, to be honest. I can imagine we've got two more I can probably think of. Obviously, Ligon and La Liga, I don't think have been done. We've had Serie A, we've had Prem. So it looks like we're going again with the same format. Makes champs a little bit. If you've definitely not caught on by now, make sure you're doing your qualies now rather than the day before, the day before that, because you can get this done relatively quickly today. Obviously, with them, we've got the play-free rival matches, pretty standard. You obviously get yourself an 81 double for that. Then, obviously, you've got play one foot champions match. As we know from previous objectives, the first five are completely based around qualies, not based around the finals. You can obviously do these in champs, but it doesn't matter where you do them if you wanted to get them done now. So, pretty much the only thing that we get different is the winning four. So, this week we've got a full team of Bundesliga and a full team of Saudi League. So, let's jump straight into the teams because that's really what matters. I'm interested to see where both of these teams are sitting at. Obviously, the Saudi will be the very hard one to do. Bundesliga should still be pretty possible. And I would always suggest whenever doing this, definitely use your worst team first. Because you do not want to go into already, say, being 4-0 in Bundesliga and then going into the Saudi. We'll make it a little bit harder. So let's have a look and see what team we can make. So we'll start off with Bundes, as I think that one should be relatively simple to make, to be honest. I feel like a lot of people would have a good amount of cards for that. So if we will go off the bench first because obviously it does need to be a full team as well i believe in the very first one i suggested that potentially you could sub off some players but i believe it has to be the whole nine has to be completely all 18 players have to be from bundesliga so we have got a few decent ones here and again we have done a couple of the sbcs we've got colo as a red striker and then we think we've got, oh, we've got Frimpong as well. We haven't even used him. Hector Endavira. We did pack Ediemi from, obviously, the 82 um, player pick, which we'll never complain about. And I think we've actually got a fair fair few top-end ones, which is always nice. We've got Sane as well. I we need to get rid of that loan then. Loans in the club, if you're like me, you've kept hold of them. There's so many loans, it's unbelievable. We're still not even out of uh, Team of the Seasons yet. That's nice. Bundesliga's looking rocking. Not saying it's the best team by an absolute landscape slide but we've got a fair few players that could definitely do it i think that is about it then so, oh yeah okay we've got a lot here so where do we want to start then so Kimmich definitely goes in in fact i can get rid of the summer i thought i was trying to get some bench players as well we would then look at mane can he be left mid in fact did i read that right he can be left mid, so that's a potential so we'll put him there for the moment we've then got becker as a center back i think that probably checks out. We do have LaCroix. We also then have Frimpongas right back. If we could just pull some of these players off the pitch, just so I could see where everybody is, that would always be handy. Then we also have Sane for the bench. In fact, what I might do, just purely for the fact that if I had full Krug and Colo up front, it might be too much of a kind of bulkier striker. So if we go Mane and Kulu, that might not be terrible. We have got a Royce as well. That's definitely not a bad shout. Can Mane, can Diaby be right mid? He could. Who else? Who do we have right mid? Was it just, it was just uh, Sane, wasn't it? Just Sane. So we could, is Royce up to it? I think we could go. We could go with Royce on the left and then go Diaby on the right. If then we've got another centre mid is, I'd say, Brandt or Adeyemi. We'll go with the new card. We'll get a fresh Adeyemi in there. We also have Koble, which is nice. And then also Hector can be in there. I think that is not a bad team. We even get the full bench of 90s. I'd say that's pretty solid. I, I Again, you obviously can change these positions. We'll kind of have a look later on. But I'd say that could definitely get four wins. Who am I missing out on? I know, obviously, we're missing out on Musiala. We've not got a Bellingham in there. A Neuer striker. Uh, who else are we missing? De Litt is obviously incredible. We don't have Goretzka. I thought I had a Goretzka. Umpra Meccano is an SBC and Kunku. We also then are missing out on Komen. I thought, did I give up a Komen? I might have given up Komen, which is silly of me. Good left mid. And I think 
that's probably the main ones that we're missing out on, which are the top of the top anyway. So to be honest, not bad. And Alfonso Davies could have been where Hector is, but again, I don't think we have him. I'd say that's a pretty solid Bundesliga. I, I reckon I could get four wins with that. I'd like to tell you about skycoach.gg. They offer many features within the FIFA franchise, from FIFA coins to FIFA weekend league boosts, from trusted sellers, pro players, and are the best prices on the market currently. They have fast delivery, high quality services, lots of games, and also a cashback program. The more coins you buy, the more eligible you are for cashback options. So if you want to buy FIFA coins at the best price, click the link in the description of this video. It will be active promo code for 10% discount from my subscribers. All you have to use is the code JT11 at the checkout to receive this bonus. On to the video. The question is, could I get it with Saudi? That That's going to be the real challenge. We don't have Ronaldo. Um, it, yeah, it's going to be one of them ones. If you've got the team, then fares, you can probably do it. If you don't, I feel like it's going to be very difficult to try and get that four wins. Do we... We, we have a lot of loans. We don't have an El Waram. We don't. We only have a Ronaldo loan at this point. I'd say that would be very, very difficult. What could we do in, in concept? Because realistically... I'm, I'm not going to be able to do that. That's just not happening. So we've got the goalkeeper, which is a team of the season. That's never a bad shout. We have a squad foundation. I'm just going for the 4-4-2 here, just as a standard. We have one team of the season, two team of the season. Did we have a left back? I believe is that squad fat World Cup star. Do we? Ha I don't thought we might have had him. Or you've obviously got a team of the season uh, objective. A silver star might not be terrible. Do we have a right wing? Is it right wing more than right mid? We have Awaran, who could be a striker as well. So we will leave him out. I believe this guy's team of the season. So we'll go with him. Any midfield, that's going to be the question. We've got a team of the season. Again, don't know if these are SBCs or not. So obviously, if you've got them, you've got them. If you've not, you might have missed them. We do have a Luis Gustavo, who I didn't actually do. And he was an objective. We then also have Taliska, who could be a striker. We'll go Gustavo, just in case you've actually done him. Left wing, have we got anybody there? Uh, squad Foundation, I thought so. I believe Squad Foundation is still in objectives as well. So make sure you are doing that if you do need, obviously, another person. We do have a CR7 that, that would be perfect in there. And I'd suggest probably our Waran would be his partner. You've got Taliska as well, who you could actually put in. He is never going to be a bad shout. Romarino, another great shout as well. Um, obviously, this is requiring a kind of no-budget team, to be honest, because CR7 is going to come in at a hefty price nonetheless. You've got a Galo, and I think it's predominantly what you're going to look at. There is obviously other versions, so Taliska doesn't have to be technically his team of the season, and you do have a few more squad foundations. But realistically... You could argue between Taliska and Alwaran, but as meta as Alwaran is, that would be your best team that you could go for in a 4-4-2. Again, if you've got the coins to splash out, I suppose, obviously, Luis Gustavo is unfortunately an objective. I don't think anybody would be that expensive other than CR7. How much is Alwaran? Okay, and, and Alwaran, apparently. But if you've done El Jabba, if you've obviously gone for Taliska, then obviously there is the chance of them, um, I think... Yeah, even T Taliska might go up in value purely for the fact that we've got this objective now. Romarino normally is the cheaper one, but to be fair, oh god damn, he's coming in at a hefty price. So you may even have to go for Al Jabba. Like I said, do the first four, you should be able to get it done. And let's just joke ourselves, let's see what Ronaldo's actually coming in at. Because I can imagine it is a hefty, hefty price. Oh wow. Oh, hold on a second. Nope, that's wrong. I was thinking then, I was like, there's no way it's coming in at 100. Okay, we're looking at 4 million. Wow. Well, I, I'm not surprised, to be honest. But again, I, I feel like you could do the Major League quite easily. It all comes down, unfortunately, to that second one, which I didn't do the one last week purely for the fact that I had the Prem, but I don't think I had the Portuguese League, I think it might have been. So if you want to just do it to get the 85 times 5, you can get the four wins if you're just going to 11 or 13, 14, whatever you need. Then four wins is not going to be that break in the bank. I feel like the Bundesliga team definitely is 
better than kind of what you kind of go with a normal team, especially if you have been doing team of the season to your absolute max and have kept the players as well. But that's going to be it. Nice and easy objective again. If you've obviously got all of them players, then you get yourself a full bonus of 85 times 10, plus obviously all the other packs just from doing qualities and obviously the rivals. Let me know if you've got them. Make sure you like and subscribe. Peace.